Hello again everyone. Um, welcome back to my page or channel, whichever you're seeing this on. Today's video, I am going to be doing a first impression sort of thing. Basically, I'm, I'm opening up something that I've had for a while and I've been wanting to open it for so long and I haven't, I swear I haven't looked at it at all. I just saw the back of it and I'm just, I'm just excited because I really want to use this. It is the Pure Dr. Seuss The Grinch Good Enough to Steal 12 Piece Collector's Face Palette and Color Changing Lip Balm. And I am so freaking excited to, to open this up. So the back of it shows the different colors you get. Oop, there we go. The different colors that there are. And there is a green lipstick that apparently is color changing probably, oh, moody color changing, so I don't know if it depends on your mood. Is it one of those? I don't know. All right, so I'm opening it up right now. So this is what the inside looks like. And, oh my God, how cute. Oh my God, it's so cute. So when you open it up, oh, this is precious. I love it. This packaging is everything. You open it up and it's got like a little pop-up, Whoville. I love it, it's so cute. All right, and it's got, obviously you saw a nice little heart-shaped mirror in there. And then the palette is underneath. So, pull that bad boy out. Ooh, oh my goodness. Those top two sparkles are Mr. Grinch and Naughty. And those just look, I wanna use that green so bad. So bad. So I am going to do some type of eye look with this and try out the color changing lip balm, but when I'm done. All right, I've already set my eyes and I've got everything else pretty much done. So I'm just going to get right into it. Okay, I'm gonna start with Cave as my transition color, which is this one right here. I've got that on there, so now I'm going to go in with Sly One. Which is that darker, almost maroon-ish shade and darken up my crease and outer corner. And next I'm going to take Who Cares, which is this shimmery light green, and go all over the rest of my lid and blend it into that um, sly one. Okay, I'm gonna add a little bit of the Fix Plus to that since it's very, it's a faint color and it's a shimmer. I kind of figured that would happen, but I'm gonna try and darken that green up a little bit. Yeah, it's a little bit. A little bit better. And now I'm just gonna take those same two colors that I used, the um, Sly One and Who Cares, and run it along my bottom line. Now I'm going to try to take the Mr. Grinch, which is that beautiful glitter green, and I'm gonna use a flat brush and try and fit it into Sly One so it doesn't have like a really harsh line of where the glitter stops. just for kicks and giggles I'm going to take the naughty which is the red glitter ignore my children in the background yes my husband is one of them I'm gonna take just a little bit of that and kind of blend it and try and blend it in with the green sparkle see how it goes it sounded like a good idea in my head Okay, now I'm going to take Feeling Frosty, which is this cute little highlighter shade, and put that right underneath my brow bone, or on my brow bone, right underneath my brow. That's a decent highlighter, actually. Pretty. Now I'm going to go um, run some eyeliner on my water lines and throw some mascara on and come back and try out the lip balm. Okay, so I threw some eyeliner and mascara. I did do a little, well, yeah, a little bit of a wing liner there. I just felt like it would be appropriate. I don't know why I just did it, but I like it. I like the palette, it's cute. Um, moving on to Moody Lip Balm. It's a color changing lip balm. And this is what it looks like. And now let's see what it changes to. It's a pretty little pink, I like it. That's so bizarre. Okay, that is absolute, I love that. I love that color. I'm usually not a lipstick person, I like glosses, but that is a really pretty color. 
right, so that is the Grinch palette and moody lipstick. I I liked it. The colors that I used, the two matte colors that I used were kind of, I don't want to say chalky, but they were. They're a little dry feeling. Um, they swatch all right though. Like here, the, I'll take the colors that I use and swatch them real quick. So this was the Who Cares, this was Cave, and this is Sly One. Let's do it right here. My nails are trash, I know. But I mean, those swatch pretty good, and they just, they feel, they're, there's just kickback in the pan, and you get a little bit of fallout underneath, but it's not a big deal. I love it. The glitters are very pretty. I would probably, next time I use this, I'll probably use a glitter glue with them, just because they are very loose. Like, I just, well, again, swatch that one. It swatch is really pretty. I mean, that is pretty. Come on. Focus. Focus. I mean, that is a pretty glitter shade. But it just, I don't know, there's something about it that I would use a glitter glue for, because it is, it is a looser, looser pigment, I would say, or a looser glitter. The lip balm, I love, I love the color of it. It's, it's cute. I really, really do like that. It's not too bright. I mean, it is a pink, but I like it. Anyway, so. Yeah, um, this again is the Pure Dr. Seuss the Grinch and good enough to steal palette. It says on the box that it retails, or it's a $198 value and the price is $42. I actually got this at Ulta when I had a 20% off card and I had enough points to get like 30 some dollars. So I got this one for free. Um, and a few other things while I was shopping. But anyways, if you guys, as always, if you guys have any questions about anything, let me know, comment below. As you may or may not know, I upload videos every Sunday. Dep <laughs> the time varies, but it's usually in the afternoon to the evening. Um, thanks, babe. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Woo!